Hi, this is the Java Coloring course by Example, and my name is Jian. Today is the day 19. I would like to talk about how to create a console selection menu in Java. Okay, so now let's get started. This is the Eclipse we are using in the previous video. And now here under the main package, I will go ahead to create a new class. Okay. So I will name it either a uh, menu selection. Create a main method. Finish button. Okay, here. So in this uh, in this demonstration, I will create a, a method uh, in static, which will be uh, generate the menus. So here in the menu, I will have some the option one, two, three, four. So in the option one, two, three, four, we will do some the uh, some specific work. But in this video today, I will only do some uh, just for some demonstration. Only take and 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 after the user select any option, so we will only display the take me assist. Okay, no, now now let's let us start it now. Okay, so here Pop. public Import some library until Okay, here I will display the message. Select the option. Okay, display some spray here, and it will be the adding a new new line. Uh, one option one. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four. Five. Okay. Okay, here so system dot print line. Okay, here we will return the selection. Okay, cool. Make in. And here, because this method menu data, we indeed are using the void, so we return the menu as uh, the, the data integer. So here, 
at the end of the at the end of the code we have to return the selection is the integer variable okay cool so here um in with the after that i will call the the method menu data inside the main menu i mean method okay here so these are user like that i will use the do why are user selected create sick as fine okay here we have five option so if the user select oh sorry if the user select uh, the option e greater than uh, five so we will display again the menu menu that sweet k uh you see select that k1 right k2 right K three right K four mm. two three right K five Four. <coughs> right. Sorry. Okay. Here. So, if the user select the option one, here, so we can execute the code of the option option one. Okay. So here, for example, in this demonstration, I will only display some of the text. So here, I will display. I will just copy this one. Put it here. Okay, I will see. Option one is like the. Thank you. No default, no needs. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so here now try to run the application and see what happened. Okay, here, so, so selected option E, okay. No, no, sorry, it should be, select should be the, it be for, be for the message. No, no, no. It, 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 correct. Okay, here. So, when you see the Zor selected option E message, that means you have to select one in five, seven here. Uh, in, uh, one in five option here. Okay. I will select the one 
it will display the message for option one is selected and thank you okay I run it again option number two run option number three okay four five okay okay I'll run it again and now I will select the data is six. It should be greater than five. So see what happened. Six. Yeah. So here after you select the six, it will display the menu again. It display the menu again. Ten again menu. So now five. Yeah, absolutely five. And after that, we uh, uh, we exit the application. Okay, good. So here, uh, based on this uh, this demonstration, you can do some customization depending on the purpose. Okay, I hope this video will will have fun for you. And do let me know if you see any issue. Bye bye, and see you later.